So at the core of what's institute here is these valuations created by, by different Trump entities and Trump family members. Who were they given to and for what purposes? And it seems, according to the evidence, that Trump and his organizations would systematically overvalue assets when it worked in their favor, and then they would systematically undervalue them when it worked in their favor. All of the the LLCs, the corporations in that Trump universe, if they're New York businesses, according to yesterday's order, they need to be uh, revoked and go in the process of winding up the business. This is a legal order. It can always be appealed up to a higher New York court. Uh, obviously, the, the defendants are going to appeal that as soon as they can. I don't suspect that we'll get that appeal until after trial. So that issue is sort of put to bed for now. We'll go through the trial process, and then the defendants will have a chance to appeal for everything that comes along. But assuming that that holds on appeal, what happened yesterday is going to be the, is be the rule, right? Those entities don't exist anymore, and the court's going to appoint somebody to essentially wind up the business for them.